How to shut down laptop using keyboard. Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can shut down your laptop using only the keyboard. Yep, no mouse, no touchpad, nothing but your keyboard. Just make sure to stick with me till the end so you don't miss any part of this shortcut. So here's the deal. We all know the usual way to shut down a laptop, and if you're someone who prefers using keyboard shortcuts to speed things up, you're going to love how simple this is. To get started, you'll want to press the Windows key and the X key at the same time. What this does is open something called the Quick Link menu. Now, this menu gives you access to a bunch of useful system tools and options like Task Manager, Settings, File Explorer, and more. Here comes the cool part. Once that menu is open, you don't need to scroll or move anything. Just press the letter U on your keyboard. That automatically selects the Shut Down or Sign Out option in the menu. But we're not done yet. After pressing U the first time, press it one more time. That second press of the U key will immediately tell your laptop to shut down. No warning, no extra prompts. It just goes straight into the shutdown process. So in total, it's just a quick three key sequence. Windows plus X, then U, then U again. That's it. Your laptop starts shutting down without you ever touching the mouse. Pretty slick, right? Now, if you're wondering what happens if you accidentally press the wrong key, no worries. If you make a mistake somewhere in the process, like hitting the wrong letter, you can just press the escape key to close the menu and start over. It's really user-friendly once you've tried it a few times. This method works great on Windows 11 and also on Windows 10 if you're still using that. All right, that wraps up this tutorial. If anything about the process is unclear or if you run into any issues, feel free to drop a comment below and I'll be happy to help you out. And hey, if this video made your life a little easier, please hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel for more easy tech tips and tricks like this. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.